What's up guys, welcome to the channel. It's Dusty, one half of our gaming and let's 100% windy freezy seas on Kirby in the Forgotten Land. First thing you're gonna have to do is save your first Waddle Dee. You're gonna have to go to the area where the bull is about to charge, go backwards and become the pipe mouthful mode. Roll down, crush everything in your path and boom, that's your first Waddle Dee. Directly after you get that Waddle Dee, be sure to get the spiky ability, go to the left, go across the platform to find a cave that's safe from the wind. That's all you have to do for this one is step inside that cave. Then when you get the boat, be sure to get the food as you go on with the boat. You'll see three different foods on the boat. First one you see is right off the bat, and that is number one of three meals to eat at sea. Directly after that, you'll keep going and keep going, and you'll see another food item. Just run into it, and that is your second of three meals to eat at sea. After you get your second food item, park the boat, go up to the top, and power the windmill. This will lower the bar that way you can smash the wall to get the waddle dee. This is your second of five waddle dees. Then as you're going to get your second waddle dee, you'll actually actually see your last food item will be available right here. That is three of three meals to eat at sea. After you park the boat, go down to the bottom right and step on the sparkle. This will reveal a ledge, then go up to the top to get the fire ability if you don't already have it. Then jump back down and then use your fire on the ice wall to get your third hidden waddle dee. Then when you're in the area where the wind is at your back, go to the left to light a lantern. This lantern will reveal some coins that will show you exactly where a hidden waddle dee on the right side down below on the map is. Bonus after that is to unthaw the scissor lift to get the blueprint for dragon fire. It'll be really, really helpful for you in the next course, in my opinion. Then when the wind is at your back still, use the fire ability to break the ice you see on the left, climb the ladder, and then the coins will reveal that on the left side, there is a drop down with some stairs. Drop down here, and then that's your secret room. That's all you have to do for this one. And then once you're down in the secret room, use a scissor lift to light the fuse, then go over and quickly jump into the cannon. When you get to the top, you'll be able to get your last waddle dee. Then of course, keep going through the course and clear the course, and you have 100% of this level. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you liked it, be sure to hit the like button. Also subscribe and turn the bells on so you don't miss a video. If you have any questions, drop them in the comment section below and I'll try to help to the best of my ability. My wife and I do stream over on Twitch. If you'd like to check that out, the link will be in the description below. We would love to have you guys over there. This is one half of Irene Gaming signing off. Everyone have an awesome day and God bless.